Hey everybody, welcome to the SMA Journey 51 blog. Today I thought I would do a quick video because I had a couple of questions by two of my YouTube subscribers that I thought were really good questions. Ones that I felt like I needed to know. So if I need to know them, I thought maybe you might like to know them as well. The first question was posed by a subscriber beneath one of my videos. And he asked me that since I'm on a high protein diet, whenever I go in for my maintenance doses next year, is this high protein diet going to skew any of the numbers in my urine sample. You know, they do measure protein in your urine, and he was afraid that these numbers may be a little bit elevated since I am on a high protein diet. So I wrote my doctor's nurse an email requesting their opinion regarding this question. Then the other question was posed by another subscriber that I was talking to on Skype. She said that one of her family members was going through this treatment, and they were measuring the amount of protein in his cerebral spinal fluid, or his CSF and she wanted to compare his numbers with mine. But I told her that I didn't even think that they were reporting the amount of protein in my CSF, because if they were, I should have received them. So I wrote my doctor's nurse another email, just asking her that if they are measuring the amount of protein in my CSF, would they send me these numbers so that I could discuss this with my subscriber. So I wanted to share these two emails with you. So after we read the emails, I'll come back and I'll give you a few final thoughts. Okay, so the first email that you're seeing on your screen was the one that I sent my doctor's nurse on Friday, December the 15th, and it pertains to the amount of high protein that I'm getting in my diet. And the email goes on to read, My physical therapist put me on a high protein diet after I completed my fourth loading dose. Along with this high protein diet, I am also drinking a 40 gram protein muscle milk. The recommended daily allowance for protein is 50 grams per day. One of my subscribers to my YouTube channel asked me if this increase in protein will negatively affect my urine sample that I get before each injection. My test results indicate that my protein level in my urine is anywhere between 11 and 18 milligrams of total protein. Since I'm trying to build more muscle, especially in my abdominal, back, and obliques, protein is essential for not only building new muscle, but are also important when repairing muscle that are being built. The extra protein that I am getting is really helping me with not only my muscle tone, but my muscles are no longer fatiguing like they used to. I wanted to get your opinion regarding this issue. Thank you, Michael P. Morale. Then the second email that you're seeing on your screen was the one that I sent my doctor's nurse on Saturday, December 16th, and it pertains to the amount of protein in the cerebral spinal fluid. And it goes on to read, I received all of my test results regarding my four loading doses of spinoza. One of my subscribers to my YouTube channel told me that one of their family members was going through this treatment and they said that they are measuring the amount of protein that is present in his cerebral spinal fluid or CSF. My question to you is are they measuring the amount of protein that is in my CSF and if so would there be a way for me to get these test results for each of my loading doses? My loading dose dates were September the 18th, October the 2nd, October 16th and November the 13th. My subscriber was concerned about the level of protein that was present in their family member's CSF and she asked me what my numbers were. I told her that I never received these numbers but I would send you an email requesting them. If they are available, I would greatly appreciate you sending them to me so I could put these on my website. Thank you in advance, Michael P. Morale. Okay, so these are two great questions ones that I need to be made aware of, and I think you need to know about them as well. So as soon as I get confirmation from my doctor's nurse, which should be either Monday or Tuesday of this coming week, I'll be doing a video around Wednesday, giving all of these answers. And if they do include the amount of protein that's in my CSF, I'll make sure that I not only give you these results in the upcoming video, I'll also put them on the test results page on my website. You can get to my website by going to www.smajourney51.com. Be sure to go out there and check it out. I think you'll find a lot of useful information. Okay, so I hope you enjoy these videos. If you do, don't forget, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I would greatly appreciate it. I hope everybody has had a wonderful weekend. And do me a favor, make it a wonderful upcoming week as well. God bless you. And until next time, bye-bye.